Friday, the Department of Labor reported unemployment rates in July were at 2.8 percent, compared to 3 percent in June. Department Commissioner Laura Fortman says these are pre-pandemic numbers, despite the fact that countless employers are still short-staffed. There are actually very few people who are unemployed right now. On the other side of that, we have employers looking for workers, and there are currently about two jobs for every one unemployed person. Fortman reminds employers to assert diversity and inclusion practices when staffing potential employees. Think about people who have traditionally been underemployed. So, for example, uh, folks with disabilities, uh, older workers, um, younger workers. And right now is a great opportunity for those folks to pursue career opportunities. Communications Director for Disability Rights Maine, Julia Endicott, says the organization advocates to increase employment for people with disabilities. Endicott says fear should not play a role in the hiring process. We know employers are are afraid of hiring somebody with disabilities because they don't necessarily know how the accommodations process works. They're afraid of something happening um, and they're they're very hesitant. Endicott notes that minor adjustments can make a big impact for an applicant living with a disability. The policy like flexible scheduling can be something uh, that means somebody with a disability is able to start working at that organization, that employer. Fortman says the Department of Labor cannot predict what's next to come in terms of unemployment trends, but encourages job seekers and employers to utilize the department's resources. A.J. Douglas, ABC 7, Fox 22.